welcome back to the channel guys and boys is this a good video for me guys so welcome back to the channel Kevin does it all I haven't made like one of these talk down videos of WWE or the whole wrestling world in a bit guys since I think last year for sure there was a lot of breaking news in 2022 like the Sasha Banks Naomi walking away I did I recorded that I thought Brock Lesnar was like after the Mr. McMahon retired also after Mr. McMahon, Brock Lesnar walked, and I did a video about that, and of course Mr. McMahon retiring, and Brock Lesnar didn't end up walking from WWE, and he's going to perform in the elim Elimination Chamber for Bobby Lashley, but this is not the predictions yet, This that will be in the next video, today I am talking about a breaking news, the news I've wanted to hear like for like what, 7 months, I don't know, maybe a since uh June I believe since the tag team match you know where I'm going Randy Orton is coming back soon guys it was not announced but uh it was I forgot who uh I think it was Lamia um, Wrestle Lamia I think it was or uh, I don't know or Productions I forgot his name but yeah I was watching a video it says we miss Randy that was the title we miss Randy Orton and I watched the video and it said that Randy Orton has like called the one that makes his boots i don't know his name he called them to make his boots for his return guys so you know what that means randy orton is returning to the ring or to like wwe real or oh, not real soon but soon he's coming back this year i am just glad first of all i'm glad he's healthy i'm glad we already like we all saw the picture going around of him in the construction like you know so what you know you guys don't want to talk about uh all jacked so we know randy orton's jacked we know he's proud to be back uh and i can't wait to see him hopefully rko someone if not punt them uh as mean as that sounds but yeah but yeah anyways guys i am so excited guys i can't wait to see randy orton and there's some matches i also and this is not gonna be just a this is mostly gonna be a randy orton episode but i'm gonna talk about one more thing so this is another sit down and talk videos and some kind of breaking news or just like n predictions kind of but yeah but not really predictions. That'll be next video of the elimination chip. But you know what I'm saying, All right? So yeah, Randy Orton's coming back. But there's also another thing. Jay Blade lost his uh loser leaves Japan. So he lost. So he has to leave Japan. Now, will he end up in AEW or will he end up in WWE where we could get some dream matches? Yes, Jay White versus Kenny Omega. I don't think we've seen that. If we have, then I'm done. But if we haven't, that will be a banger match. Come on, man. We need him to come to WWE, please. Jay White vs. AJ Styles slap match. Jay White vs. Randy Orton. That's going to be a banger. Jay White vs. Cody Rhodes. Like, the storylines are good. Jay White vs. Roman Reigns. Jay White vs. Sheamus. Banger, banger. Drew McIntyre. It's going to be fire, Jay White. Do you hear the bell? Me there. Yeah. Be there. Okay, it's gonna be a banger, Jay White. Sorry, my dad just walked in. Rude AF. But anyways, Jay White versus I don't know, freaking maybe actually this won't be a bad match. Jay White versus freaking Ricochet. That would be a banger. Jay White versus Johnny Gargano. I'm leaving that in the uh, in the video by the way. My dad. Well, not really walking, but you know, just uh. But yeah, Jay White first. There's a lot of matches like Jay White versus. Like a t Montez Ford, that would be a banger. Like just, there's a lot of matches that could go down with Jay White. I am so excited to see where he goes. If he ends up with AEW, I don't watch AEW. I know about it. Obviously, it's good promotion for sure. I don't hate it, but I just don't watch it. And even if I could, uh, I can't. Even if I would want to, I can't because like it's expensive to watch the pay per views, and I can't. I don't have like Direct TV. I just watch the highlights of Raw. But I could see the pay per views. I have Peacock, yeah. But yeah, so. I really hope Jay White comes to WWE like the banger matches he'll have. And not only that, but he's like he's gonna come back. People are gonna know him. Like AJ Styles, they knew him. It would have been fun if he debuted at the Royal Rumble, which I thought he was, but uh, they didn't. They didn't have the Japan Loser Leave match yet. If it would have been before, then that would probably set it up to Royal Rumble return or debut. But no, I really want to see him debut in WWE. Uh, and yeah, uh. I hope Jay White uh, debuts in WWE. Some, some of my family members, that's why my dad interrupted me. But yeah, they only talk Spanish, by the way. I don't have to talk about it. Whatever, they interrupted me. Who cares? Well, I'm here to talk about Randy and Jay White. So yeah, Randy Orton, I really like my second favorite wrestler. Tied with John Cena. Well, not tied, but he's my second. John Cena's my first. You know what? There's another segment. My top five wrestlers of Kevin. 
Alright, number one, John Cena. Number two, Randy freaking Orton. Randy Keith Orton. Randy Kill Orton. Three. Oh, shoot, I haven't gotten this far. Oof. I haven't thought about this in a while, actually. Alright, so from all time, three, Stone Cold. Four would have to be either Jeff or Randy. Uh, uh pff, Randy or uh, Ray. Probably Ray Mystery and then Jeff Hardy. Six, Seth Rollins. And yeah. But yeah, those are my top five, six wrestlers. Uh, John Moxley will also be tied with Seth Rollins. So yeah, and my favorite top five, another segment, my top five tag teams. Uh, first, D-Generation X. Second, the Hardys. Oh, wait, no, the first one has to be the Shield. The second one, the Hardys. Third, D-Generation -Gen X. Four would probably be RK Bro or Rated RKO tied. Basically, any Randy Orton. Number five. Either Brothers of Destruction or uh, the Usos or the Bloodline. It's a lot. The Usos probably. Number 6, New Day. And, you know, blah, blah, blah. Number 7, Heart Foundation and all that shit. But, yeah, guys. Those are the breaking... Well, not breaking news, but just news I wanted to talk about. Uh, So, yeah. If you want to see more videos, yay. I have 300 subscribers, guys. Please make that a 400 subscribers. I really think we can make it to 1,000 before 2023. I'm saying like it's already gonna be like Christmas, but before 2024 arrives, please can we have a dozen like a uh, thousand subscribers? That would be a dream. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this. Jay White, hopefully please come back. Uh, don't come back. Please debut at WWE. The matches are um, like they're gonna be bangers after banger, banger, bangers. Hey, hopefully I can't wait to see what happens in the next month. He might even show up at WrestleMania. He might debut at WrestleMania like Cody. But yeah, just I hope Jay White. Debuts, but one no, one man we know is gonna return to WWE is Randy Orton. I'm so excited. Randy Orton's returning soon to WWE, and Blade White, oh, pff, the Switchblade Jay White might debut at WWE. Those are the the sitting down with Kevin uh podcast right here. If you want to see whatever, I uh, hopefully you enjoyed this. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you in the Elimination Chamber 2022 predictions. And yeah, let's go, Sammy. Woo! See you in the next one. Peace. Let's go, Sammy. Ooh, see. Ooh, see.